What mansion of the moon were you born in? You may know your sun sign. It's the sign of the zodiac the sun rose in the day you were born. But do you know the moon's location that day may be equally important to understanding your life and spirit? If the zodiac is divided into 12 parts, you get the well-known sun signs like Virgo and Aquarius. If it is divided into 28 parts, you get the mansions of the moon. The moon visits one of them each day during its 28-day orbit of the Earth. Knowing which mansion the moon was in when you were born will give you great insight into yourself, perhaps much more than knowing you are a Pisces or a Gemini. You see, the moon's influence is much more spiritual and emotional than the sun sign's influences. And here's how to find your birth mansion. And don't worry about taking notes. There are links to the instructions in the comment section below. Step 1. Go to the Moon Sign Calculator. It is on the web at lunarium.co.uk. Step 2. Enter your birth information. And here's an example for someone born on May 9th, 2001 at 8 a.m. Pacific Time. Step 3. Press the Calculate Moon Sign button. The calculator will refresh and give you your birth sign and degree. Step 4. Use this chart to find out which mansion of the moon you were born in. A link to the chart is in the comments below. On the chart, we find where the moon was at Sagittarius 14 degrees 5 minutes. That location is on the line Sagittarius 4 degrees 17 minutes to Sagittarius 17 degrees 8 minutes. 14 degrees is between 4 degrees and 17 degrees. So, that person was born while the moon was in the mansion of the flame of passion. Now to explore your moon birth mansion and learn a lot more about yourself, check out our YouTube videos about a particular mansion. If you want to explore your birth mansion and its meaning in even more depth, the Crystal Inner Circle has a crystal astrology community with experts to help. Now, as you go, we encourage you to find your birth mansion and your special gifts from the moon. <laughs>